Hello, my name is Mason Matthews. I'm a postdoctoral research associate at the Natural Hazard Center at the University of Colorado Boulder. In this video, I'm going to describe how to use the Near Me widget in the Global Hazards and Disasters Research Center's web map application. The web map was created by the Natural Hazard Center team in partnership with ESRI and with the support of the National Science Foundation. So we will start here at hazards.colorado.edu. We'll go to resources and research centers, and that will take us to the web map application. And we'll start by seeing the splash widget, which gives us some information about the project and tells us where to find the data that's used in the web map. Click OK there. And today we're going to use the Near Me widget, which is up here in our widget bar. Um, right next to the info summary widget. And the Near Me widget allows you to find research centers within a buffer of a defined address or location, and then view detailed information about those research centers. So today we're going to find research centers near the Wall of Wind Experimental Facility at Florida International University in Miami. So we will start by clicking on the Near Me widget. And in this case, we know the name of the center, so we'll make sure that we go to the Hazards and Disaster Research Center layers, and we'll type in Wall of Wind. Comes up there. First, let's set our buffer to 100 miles. So we'll look for centers within 100 miles of the Wall of Wind. So let's click on that. And it zooms us right in there to South Florida. We can see our we can see our buffer. Let's scroll down a little bit. We can see the wall of wind right here. Uh, if we want to, we can click on this logo here in the pop-up and it'll take us to the wall of winds website and we can learn a little bit more about who they are and what they do. Let's go back to the map. Um, and the Near Me widget has given us a list of the centers that are within 100 miles of the Wall of Wind <clears throat> and some information about how far away each center is. And if we click on a center in that list, we find a little bit more information. Again, we could go to their website if we want to. And we can go back. And so that's kind of a nice op option to search for centers in a particular area. The other option that we have, let's go ahead and zoom back out here. Uh, the other option we have for the Near Me widget is to select by point. So we don't have an address, but we know kind of where we want to search for centers we can click on this set location point. Let's do that, let's look for centers in Southern Louisiana. Click on that and we found all the centers that are within 100 miles of this particular point. So once again, we can go through and look at the uh, information about each of those centers see how far they are away. And so those are kind of nice options there for the Near Me widget. Uh, we hope this tutorial was useful for you. Please see our other videos associated with the Global Hazards and Disaster Research Center's map. Thank you for watching today and good luck. And once again, we'd like to acknowledge uh, our partners at ESRI and the support of the National Science Foundation in making this project possible. Thank you.